Eighteen years district transfer of land act 1959 was made by the Mikirhills Autonomous District Council. In 1969, more power was demanded by elected Congress MLAs and MDCs, including two ministers, and rejected autonomous hill, hill state, but instead received less power. Hmm. Demanded more power, received less power, by empowering a some government to prevent the autonomous district councils from making laws for conducting election, council elections and preparing, preparing council voters list by inserting with the approval of the governor in para 27 of the six schedule, even for introducing the bill in the autonomous district council, even for introducing also the approval of the government is needed. But they thought that they got more power. Hmm. In 1995, Para 3 was diluted by inserting alienation of land in a new Para 3A. Close O. This insertion lowered down the sixth schedule, a mini constitution, to simply a land and revenue act. See how it happens. In sixth schedule is a mini constitution. But by inserting <coughs> land settlement matter in it, it was brought down to the level of an act, a land revenue act. That's that it happened. Because from the beginning, in the uh, constituent assembly itself, opposition to Sikh schedule was very strong. So they took any, or any opportunity to make it weaker all the time, even today. Secular, the mini constitution is now legal terms like transfer of land, settlement of land, etc., are to be put in the Land and Revenue Act, which is actually yet to be made under paragraph 3. And these words like settlement or transfer, etc., are to be written in an act, not in constitution. If you read the whole of Constitution of India, there is no mention of settlement of land or transfer of land in the Constitution. Because it is a Constitution. Constitution is for building a country, not for land settlement. Now we thought that this Sikh schedule is a, a, an act to protect culture, this and that thing. It is not that. It is not culture matter. It includes the whole of the nation. That means it includes a, a, a culture also anything. This culture anything need not be mentioned in the constitution. It is automatically included. Now, now another point. Uh, this has happened in the two districts of uh, these things. I don't know where I left it. Uh, here, the scheduled tribes people are reduced to abject poverty now. 90% of the dwelling houses of scheduled tribes are made of bamboo and mud plaster with torn walls and damp ardent floors on which the children sleep. In their kitchen, not even one feast of rice can be seen. Most of the schools in villages are closed because persons from cities are appointed as teachers who do not attend the schools where they are posted. The elected members do not appoint a local scheduled tribe persons as teachers because they are afraid of losing next election due to heavy increase of the voters of non-tribes people. This is the result of not making election rules by the Autonomous Council composed of uh, members of the Shido tribe. A large number of Shido tribe people are denied of having polling station, LP schools near their villages. Many have to walk up, up and down through the hills in forests. The distance of 7 kilometers to 60 kilometers or 70 kilometers to cast their votes. Hmm. Tribal people are not given even polling centers. Very funny. How 
It is happening. It is happening right there in Singlason Hills. And in LP school also. During ASDC government, they established one LP school. That also brought down in 2002. Now they have got no schools also. All children without education there. Yesterday, just last year we went. 68 children without education. If election rules are not made under paragraph 2 sub paragraph 7 by autonomous council composed of only Shidro tribe members, all other laws to be made under the Sikh schedule cannot be made for the benefit of the Shidro tribe. This has been proved in Karbian law, West Karbian law and Dimasa law. See, they, are, they have not made the law. We have uh, filed a case in high court. We won high uh, court also. And the council are afraid to make the law because non-tribal people are now almost majority. Our population was 96% tribal people in 1951. Now in 2011, our tribal population is 56%. And now in 2021 uh, uh, census, uh, it is reported we are only 47%. According to the law of natural justice, it is no more a tribal area. See, this has happened. And now we are afraid. Our elected people are afraid of non-tribal people. So they are afraid to make any law also. They are afraid even to appoint tribal people. The chokidars, peons are selected in uh, this pool. They pass a law, direct recruitment law. Nobody oppose it. MLAs are afraid to oppose it. We wrote to the MLAs. Some of them even afraid to receive our letter. They return it. Only one MLA, he received it and replied to us. But it could not be done. This direct recruitment is there. Now, the other part of the Sikh schedule is making of law for recognizing traditional village councils of the tribe people by whatever name called. Hmm. The Constitution of India by, uh, by Article 243D has given freedom to the tribes, to the scheduled tribes to retain and utilize their traditional village councils by whatever name called. This means that the autonomous council constituted by the Sikh schedule must make laws to retain and utilize for all government purposes the traditional village councils of all the scheduled tribes of different names. The uh, Karbis have the servant kept Rengmaga Nagas have Ninjang Tiru Gwilnyu Songsak Wen Dimasa have uh, Raji Naisoko, Kuki Mar tribes have Tulsum Vaisa, Shyam tribe has uh, Mukpom Chauhuban, Garo tribe has Songko Dilgapa, Khasi Jaintya has Darbar Shnom, Tiwa tribe has Shining Pisai, and Bodo tribe has uh, Gamiari Afar. Some leaders of some tribes may uh, say that their traditional village councils are not constituted, uh, are constituted not by election. So, their traditional village councils are not equivalent to panchayats of the non-tribal people. We must not forget that elections in democracy is a new system. Even panchayats were not constituted by elections in earlier days. Panchayats have been modified and improved. It is no more a five-member village council, Pon Chayot, five-member council, but now 20 members, but still we call it Pon Chayot. Pon Chayot has become a nomenclature, not the numbers of the members. Likewise, if the Pon Chayot, more than 2,000 years old, they modified it and improved it and used for development purposes and everything of the government, why not our traditional village council, Serwan Cap? It can be used. We call it Serwan Cap, but actually there are 12 members. We also. Because some time ago, 
So I don't know about 50 or uh, 100 years ago, this was amended. That is why, although it is called servant care, the members are 12. Now we can uh, increase, increase it to 16. Sir, we are uh, sorry. We yeah, have to just, just ending. So that there are some and, questions. Yeah, just okay. ending. Just okay. ending. Yeah. Sure the Therefore, as mandated. Yes. Yeah. Therefore, as mandated by paragraph two, sub paragraph seven of the six schedule, and as per judgment passed by the Honorable High Court on 13/7/2018 in PIL case number nine 2017, all the ten. Autonomous district or territorial council must first of all make law for conduct of elections of the autonomous or territorial councils. Conduct of elections includes preparation of electoral rolls. Let us also wake up to make laws under paragraph 3, 1, E, F, G of the sixth schedule to the constitution of India to keep, uh, to keep Traditional council by whatever name called alive. We let us keep our traditional village council alive and working to retain identity of our tribes and for progress. Thank you. Now, should I say a little, uh, see, uh, there are, I think when they inside, there are some points to be said. Whenever I say it is very long, however, I think there is no more time. <laughs> Sir, I think we will have some discussion and uh, we could add uh, more. I uh, can't tell you how interesting your points were and it's really hard, but since we are running late, we'll have them during the discussion. All right.